hi friends welcome back so in this video i will be discussing about what is manual testing what is automation testing what is the difference between manual testing and automation testing in this video the first we will try to understand what is manual testing the manual testing is nothing but where we will be testing the uh, your application the application can be anything your railway reservation system your car booking application your banking application or any application in that matter completely manually without using any automated tools that is all about a manual testing and everything will be verified by the human being in a manual way that is all about a manual testing where you will be comparing the expected results with the actual results if both expected and actual results are same then the manual tester will make the test case as pass otherwise you will make the test case as fail and you will lock the defect or a bug where manual verification is more of a primitive form of software testing this is the first step in any software testing and this kind of manual testing can be done by anybody without having any knowledge on any automation tools or any tools in that matter even uh, a student can be executable these test cases even person is having a very limited knowledge on that application can also execute these test cases and they can verify and they can lock the defect this is all about a manual testing then what is all about a automated testing the automated testings where we will be writing the test cases by using a programming languages or scripts or anything like that where entire programming is involved by using programming we will be developing lot of frameworks to run the overall automated test scripts the framework whatever we developed using programming languages or scripts can contain many components such as uh, where we will be writing the separate uh, libraries common libraries we will be writing for a particular functions which can be reused even lot of test data sources also would be required to be created either in excel format csv format or text format all the data which is required to execute the test cases we should keep in this uh, repository and even we should identify different objects as well because in automation tools every object is recognized by the object details all this object will also be kept in the object repository and it is also to be required to be well maintained as well and any other reusable models also will be kept in this framework components by using this overall automated framework we will be running our test then we will get the results again this framework can be in a various forms it could be a simple framework or a structured framework it can be having a data driven approach or keyword driven approach or it can be both of data driven or keyboard driven which is hybrid form or in agile based uh, automated testing so any of these testing can be used while uh, making an automation testing then we will try to understand what is the difference between manual testing and automation testing when to use manual testing and when not to use automation testing the first criteria we will try to see is accuracy by following manual testing we will have a little lower accuracy because human is involved when human is involved if you just execute one test case or two test case or 10 test case is fine we can expect good accuracy if you are trying to force the tester to execute hundreds of test cases in a day or within a week then you will get bored when we is executing thousands of test cases it may happen that he may miss many things because we do everything manually then the accuracy of manual testing executions also become very lower yeah. but in terms of automated testing because here yeah, the computers are involved once we are scripted or once we are programmed then it runs keep running without having any issues where we will get higher accuracy as well and the second aspect is the kind of investment we would be required for manual testing and automation testing normally for manual testing initial cost is very less because we will be only involving our manual tester to run the test cases but 
in the long run we may find lot of uh, issues because it consumes lot of effort in uh, executing the test cases in a longer run but in automated test cases initial investment will be higher because we wanted to procure the automation tools but in the longer run we get a lot of benefits as well because we will be keep running the same test hundreds of time then the return of investment will be very huge while doing automated testing then uh, the next criteria would be the scale and efforts the manual testing definitely we cannot uh, take up in a large scale project because it involves huge cost it involves good amount of efforts are required time is required by just following the manual testing but automated testing will have a very efficient mechanism and also less efforts are required because everything is automated only computers are executing this automated test the cost effectiveness as we discussed earlier initial stages you would be required to be hired lot of testing professionals the cost of the testing professionals also very high and we have to keep executing thousands of test cases then we would be required too much efforts cost time everything in manual testing but automated testing the cost will get saved as we run the test cases in a longer run when the infrastructure is ready tools are ready then we can save lot of uh, cost efforts as well in automated testing then the next type of difference is user experience especially user experience test we normally accommodated only using manual testing we may not use it by automation testing because wherever human beings are there where human can think differently that is the place user experience test cases are more suitable but in automation testing we cannot cover up all these experience based testing and also in manual testing we cannot bring the batch mode of testing where i wanted to group 10 test cases 20 test cases and we wanted to run all these 10 test cases 20 test cases together but in automated way you can definitely run all these 10 test cases 20 test cases together in a batch mode in a nightly manner by using automated testing but same thing we cannot accommodate it in the manual testing the next type of testing would be the specialization we wanted to understand that when we normally use manual testing the manual testing normally we adopt while we are doing ad hoc testing exploratory testing usability testing this kind of testing we normally prefer manual testing but in automated testing the whenever we performing the regression testing load testing performance testing repeated execution then we will be bringing the automation testing and as we discussed earlier the user skills especially if you wanted to mimic the user behavior definitely automated tests cannot uh, accommodate but in manual testing definitely we can uh, execute the user behaviors very easily and the kind of programming knowledge is required for manual testing is very much uh, nil we can say not required for manual testing but for automation testing the programming skills are very much uh, required uh, for automated testing and the next type of difference is engagement especially the repetitive test executions if you do in the manual testing as we keep executing thousands of test cases every day it may feel that it is very tedious lot of error phone and even manual testers feel bored as well and they may quit the job as well that is a key problem in a manual testing but in automation testing because you use tools we may see more accuracy and we may get the better results as well and also our testers feel challenged every day because they will be keep programming they will keep adding automated scripts every day they will be feeling uh, more encouraged as well and when we wanted to use manual testing is whenever we wanted to execute once or twice in the overall life cycle of the test case then definitely we should go for manual testing otherwise we should go for automated testing where we'll be keep executing the test more often more often in hundreds of times then definitely we recommend for going for automated testing the kind of risk uh, while doing manual testing is very high because it consumes lot of efforts lot of resources lot of efforts then higher risk of uh, not meeting the deadlines as well because it may happen that we may get into challenges or somebody leave the company and so on and so on then 
with these challenges definitely we may feel that uh, higher risk and we may not meet deadlines or schedule as well and when come to automation the, it may not be a very high risk it can be a zero or i can say medium risk as well with a schedule or deadlines which can be easily accommodable uh, using automated testing so these are the certain important aspects of manual testing and automation testing and their differences i am hoping uh, this video was very useful for you guys if you guys really like this video click on like button if you guys are not subscribed then do subscribe thanks for watching this video bye for now take care